What is going on people? It is your guy James Roth. Thank you guys so much for checking out this video. Today's video, we are going to be talking about the upcoming Yeezy December 2019 releases. Make sure you get your pen and your paper together guys because it's going to be a lot of Yeezys dropping. Reason why you want to watch this video because you need to plan ahead with Yeezys, you know what I mean? A lot of Yeezys aren't easy to get. So if you want to be L free for the month of December, I suggest you watch this video. And if you don't mind, please give me a like. It will go a very long way. Now the very first Yeezy release that we're going to get in December is on December 7th. We are going to get the Yeezy Slides. There should be three colorways dropping on the same day, on the 7th of December. Desert Zan colorway is like a tan slide, while the resin colorway is like an olive slide, and you got the bone white colorway, which is basically an all white slide. These slides are gonna cost $55 USD, and from checking the temperature online, everyone is not really too big on the slides, but if you really want these slides, these slides should be easy to get. I think they might be online release so far, but I do know Yeezy retailers are gonna have them. Not sure if Foot Locker and all the other foot stores are gonna have them, but these should be an easy cop. On December 14th, we will be getting another Yeezy 350 drop. These sneakers will be the Yeezy Real 350s. Disclaimer, these 350s are going to be non-reflectives. The reflective version is gonna come out afterwards, but we'll get to that. But right now, we got the non-reflectives. These sneakers are in a neon green colorway not as bright as the original glow-in-the-dark 350s but it's kind of similar but the major difference from the original glow-in-the-darks that dropped a couple months ago is that the prominent on this sneaker is actually in a black colorway so the sneaker is basically two-tone the neon green base colorway with black stitching on the sneaker it's going to have a pull tab in the back of the sneaker and also the shoelaces will be in a mint green colorway these sneakers will not have 3m shoelaces I am depressed by that. And lastly, this sneaker will have like a yellow translucent stripe colorway. These sneakers will be $220 USD. Resale value for the sneaker will not be high. It will not go over $100 retail for sure. I don't care what size you are. We have so many Yeezys dropping in December, I highly doubt that these sneakers will sell out. But for me personally, I might have to pass on the sneaker because I am not in love with the shoelaces. The shoelaces is kind of turning me off a little bit. Plus, I have the original Glow in the Dark 350s in my collection, so I don't really think there's a need to cop these. For December 16th, I think we have one of the most anticipated, anticipated Yeezys of 2019. We are talking the Yeezy 500 High Slate. This sneaker is basically the winterized version of the original 500. The sneaker is gonna be in high top, of course. It is called the 500 High. This sneaker has a navy blue neoprene base with a white Adati preen midsole. And you also have some black along the heel of the sneaker. The retail price for the sneaker is expected to be $220. I think the resale price for the sneaker is going to be at medium. It's going to be a little high. 500s is not what's killing the market right now, so we can use that for an account. This sneaker is very, very stylish. It's very luxurious. I'm telling you, when you wear these sneakers, you feel like a millionaire. That's how these sneakers are looking right now. For December the 17th, we are going to get the reflective. You heard me? The reflective Yeezy Real Yeezy 350s. These are basically the same design as the non-reflective version of the sneaker, but the only difference is that the whole upper of the sneaker is made of 3M. Translation, it gets super bright once the light hits the sneaker. The shoelaces will not be in 3M. It will still come in this mint green colorway. It will not be 3M, and that is a killer. But these sneakers still will have high resale value because these sneakers will be limited. These will be available on adidas.com and also they will be available on yeezysupply.com at a random time. So if you're trying to get these sneakers, you gotta be glued to your phone, man, because these sneakers can drop at any time. Now on December 18th, we have one of my favorite Yeezys, my favorite Yeezys. We got the Yeezy 700 Carbon Blue V1s. You guys know I love V1s. It is my favorite Yeezy of all time, and this colorway is super dope. Now, this sneaker is like the what the version of the Yeezy 700. This Yeezy is like the mixture of one of the most successful Yeezy 700s. This sneaker is a mixture of the Yeezy 700 Mauves, the Inertias, the Wave Runners, and also the Salt 700s. This sneaker will come at a retail price of $300, man. I just hate saying that, man. $300, man. Every time I say the number 300, it seems like my wallet is just 
running out my pocket as we speak. But the good news is that the resale value on this sneaker will be extremely low. Yeezy 700s have not done well in the year 2019. They have basically all just flopped. Most of the 700s that dropped this year are under retail on aftermarket websites as we speak, man. So if you really want these kicks like I do, it should not be a hard cop whatsoever. Now for the December 19th release, we might have the most anticipated Yeezy 350 or probably the most anticipated Yeezy of the year. We have the Yeechill Yeezy 350s the reflective version. This is a black Yeezy 350 with some reds, grays, and blues inside the colorway. It has a very, very unique stitching pattern. Kind of makes the sneaker look 3D. For the reflective version of the sneaker, the prominent on the inside of the sneaker and also on the outsides right under the translucent stripe will be in 3M. And also the shoelaces will be in 3M as well. God, I love that 3M shoelace look, man. And also, this sneaker does not have a pull tab, so when you're trying to put these sneakers on, be careful, man. You won't want to rip this sneaker apart, man. These will be one of the most hyped Yeezys that will drop in 2019. I really think these sneakers will do better than the black 350s that dropped a couple months ago, actually. Remember those videos that we saw on people in China basically stampeding inside the mall to get those black 350s? Yeah, it's going to be like this, Felice but two times worse. So if you want to buy this sneaker, you're going to have to put some footwork in, man. This will not be an easy release. If you do wind up catching the L on these sneakers, the resale price of these sneakers are going to go through the roof. Because we all know Yeezy reflective sneakers are very limited, therefore, these sneakers will be a lot of money on the black market. And just in case you do come up with an L with those reflective Yeezys, we will be getting another pair dropping on the day after, on December 20th. We are going to be getting the non-reflective version of the Yachil 350s. This sneaker is made the same way as the reflective version, but the only difference is that the prominent is not made of 3M. But let me tell you, the good news is the shoelaces will still be 3M. You guys down at Adidas, man. Love you guys. Even though these sneakers will be a general release, these still will be limited. They will not be easy to get as well. So put in your footwork. Make sure you subscribe to this channel to stay up to date on this release so you can cop these sneakers, man, because these sneakers are definitely fire. And lastly, we are closing the year out with some brand new Yeezys, a brand new model. Just 100% brand new. We got the Yeezy Azrael 700 V3s. This sneaker is in a black, white, and gray colorway. We got the exoskeleton on the outsides of the sneaker. And also one crucial thing about that exoskeleton, it also glows in the dark. These sneakers are fire, man. Just fire. The only kicker, these sneakers are not made with the Dita Boost, man. Oh my God. These sneakers do not have the Boost midsole actually made with a different material, a quite, Cheaper material, I don't want to say a cheap, I'm gonna just keep it one. It's a cheaper material than the regular 700s. Because we don't got the boost midsole, these sneakers will be a lot cheaper than the original 700s. These sneakers are expected to be $180. It's kind of hard to give you guys a prediction for these sneakers because this is a brand new sneaker, but a lot of people aren't happy with the fact that it doesn't have any boost this sneaker. I really don't think it's a big deal. I like the fact that we are getting a pair of 700s that's not $300 for once, and I think the quality of the sneaker will still be very good. I'm very confident in this new sneaker. So make sure you guys let me know in the comments, what sneakers are you going after in December? For me, I'm going after the new Chill 350s and also the new 700 V3s. So come on guys, come talk to me, come holler. Thank you guys so much for checking out this video. I'll see you guys when I see you. Peace.